Michigan Central and New Lab Art and Technology Residency Program is really unique, not just in Detroit, but also nationally and internationally, as a real opportunity to welcome artists to be part of an innovation community. Backing that promise up with the idea that they receive $30,000, as well as access to one-of-a-kind, unique facilities within Michigan Central and the New Lab campus, what's most important is the way they both form and forge community and are welcomed into this innovation campus as vital members of how we sort of see getting to the future together. Hi, my name is Cezanne Charles and I'm a partner and founder at Root of Two. My name is John Marshall and I'm also a partner and founder at Root of Two. And we've been working with Michigan Central and New Lab on the Art and Technology Residency for 2024. Uh, what motivated me to be part of the New Lab Residency is the fact that it is a, it's a tremendous opportunity to work on a project that I care about and to be able to explore all the, uh, the facilities that have uh, incredible, incredible fabrication technology and to be able to use those tools uh, not just to deliver a product but to actually learn how they work, how they function and then to be able to, to create new things. It's really a dream, a dream residency because there's support, there's, uh, there's space for, for growth, um, and then there's also uh, a lot of uh, embeddedness within the community. I, I have never had the time to really dive into um, parametric modeling and, and 3D modeling. And, um, and uh, I mean, I've used it in my practice a lot before, but, but never been like, to make components and parts and things that fit together, you know, I would just design furniture with it and, and, and it would be just a, a sketch more than a, an actual working model. One of the big things I'm getting out of the residency is just a, 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 um, a much stronger grip on, on the, on the uh, modeling technology and on, the, on the, uh, the, the more digital side of creation. There are really uh, amazing artists in this program that the more that I overlap and engage with them, I'm learning from, I'm learning from their practice and I'm being inspired by them. And so, yeah, I think there's some long-term like benefits from being able to work on what I'm working on in a con concentrated way here and then being able to think about how beyond this um, experience I could continue to um, build and evolve my projects while working with others on theirs. I've had a lot of residencies where I'm asked to move to a different town or a state um, and live there for a little while and then make some work and I love that um, but I think it's something different when you're asked to think and experiment and make something when you live just down the street. This particular residency is meaningful because it allows me to think alongside the community members that I'm already spending time with outside of these residency halls and then ask their opinion and show them various stages of my project in a way that feels organic and not sort of constrained to um, the same kind of timeline that might be in place if I were in a residency sort of out of town or in a different space. I think having an opportunity like this on the map has the potential to influence other emerging artists in the city to push the boundaries of their own practices and redefine the role that their art can have here and anywhere. I also believe that technology can and should be used to make life easier and more interesting and I think that having artists and designers in tech is a large part of how we get there. I think um, the program is still uh, in its primordial state, which is a really exciting time to be here. And I think the future is only promising more exciting outcomes. Experimental art actually has a long history of working with technology from like early photography to uh, more modern uh, experiments with bio art and hypothetical futures. But I think art as a catalyst for dynamic um, thinking with emerging anything, science or tech, uh, is always an interesting way to approach diverse outcomes for these sort of 
new systems. Uh, I think, yeah, I mean, what could possibly go wrong? Inviting artists into uh, a tech building like this, yeah.